Hello everyone, welcome to you on Think Future Academy. Today we are going to learn how to convert pivot filters data into different tabs. Let's begin. This is my data and here there are different regions and employees are working. Here I have created the pivot table and here these are the regions I have created on a single click. How it happens, it is very easy and it's very unique method and you can convert your data very quickly instead of copying and pasting your data from different regions. You can do it with the help of pivot tables very easily. So we will see that one. First of all, I'm going to remove all of them and then we will have a look on the data that how we can do that one. I'm going to delete them and I'm going to remove my pivot as well. Pivot is removed. Now my data is available. First of all, I have created my data as table. If you don't know, it's very easy. Table design, convert to range. I'm converting my data as it is back in the table format. Now select all my data insert table and click OK all is all your data been converted into table format now and here it's data I will write the name data what will be the impact of this one you will see it now insert pivot table and you can see your data will be here and here is your sheet I'm renaming it as a pivot and now I'm putting my employee names here their total income total expenditure net income and you can see it here and now I'm going to select my region as a filter here you can see here all my values are there now I will make little bit bigger form in this format and which will help you to read it easily you can see it here now what I'm going to do I'm looking to manage my data arrange my data in a professional methodology way see here expenditure I'm making it as a this one income is this and I will go, I'm going to remove some of and just putting one space here I'm going to remove it here from and putting one space here and net income at the end one space and that's all here I will write employee names so it will help us to identify the employees as well and one more thing which I am going to do it right click go to pivot options and auto fit now it will not change any of the adjustments of my data whatever it is going on otherwise what it can happen if I'm selecting any of the data it can make changes so now I can select my data as per my filter you can see here data is available now and I am going to select all of them now as of now and now the trick will start just go on to your pivot table analysis and here there is option if you will click on the option the same pivot table option will open for you but if you will click on the down arrow here you can see it here down arrow very small arrow then you can just click on it and show filter pages you can see it the second option show filter pages now I'm going to click on show filter pages okay and yes my data is available you can see it here my data all based on the region Abu Dhabi region all employees are there you can see it then Ajman, Dubai, and based on different cities, Islamabad, Karachi, Lahore, and everybody. You can see the data it's available. It's very unique method while you're working. 
it will help you a lot instead of copying and pasting your data from one sheet to another sheet with the help of pivot tables you can do it very quickly you must try it i will attach this excel sheet with my video link will be down you can download from the link thank you very much